What I love about Sydney is its diversity. I think from the east to the west, from the CBD to the urban fringe, Sydney is so diverse. You can't come across a city like Sydney um, very often traveling around the world. And I think its architecture really reflects that. We're in a really exciting period right now where our architecture is exploring what a cult multicultural city means to Sydney and to its people. To me as an urban planner, I guess architecture is more than built form or more than structure or more than shelter, it's about people and it's about the lived experiences that inhabit those spaces. It's really interesting, the story behind the space as well and the architect and their team that was involved in the creation of the building. It was also, I guess, an attraction for me to get involved with cities. You know, cities are really inspiring and one of the major things that makes them inspiring is their architecture and how the architecture connects with the built form and, and the public realm and, and the places that everyone inhabits. My favourite building in the world is the Sydney Opera House. Um, for me, growing up outside Sydney, it was more than just a building. Every time we visited, we visited the Sydney Opera House and for me, it kind of sparked this interest in cities and it was by far more than just a building. It was, it was a symbol and it was a symbol that triggered those emotions for me to pursue my own career. And I'm continuously amazed at Woodson's masterpiece. It's incredible. To me, future heritage, I guess, starts now. It's in the present. And that's why I think the work that Sydney Living Museums is doing and also Sydney Open is so important. You know, we need to be exploring, discussing and celebrating these buildings that are being built today so that in the future we can continuously have a legacy and an involvement and relationship with those buildings. My best advice for people wanting to explore the program is just to get in early. You've got to get in early. Tickets, some tickets in particular, go really fast and the program has so much to offer. This year, 70 buildings and second piece of advice would just be block out both those days and get along to as much as possible.